Celebrating the baby boomer lifestyle. This is Boomer Life with Sterling Fox on AM 650. Talking retirement living at Shannon Oaks in Vancouver. Our guests in studio, Jillian Fullerton from Baptist Housing Sales and Marketing in Shannon Oaks is a Baptist housing retirement community. Yeah. And from Shannon Oaks, Sharon Ginter, the activity manager down there. Sharon brought along a menu, and you do this every month. Every day of every month, you've got all sorts of activities, uh, each day accounted for. Uh, can I ask you about a few of these yeah, things? Absolutely. I recognize, I mean, I recognize the pancake breakfast, and I, <laughs> I get carpet bowling, yeah. and we bowling, yeah. we talked about that already, but what on earth is the Conversation Cafe, Sharon? Conversation Cafe was, I found that a lot of the residents actually just love interacting with each other. Okay. So I decided to kind of have a formal time to do it. So I, every month we get together and there's a, it's not a huge group because you want it kind of small and intimate. Okay. And so we discuss, I have a whole bunch of questions. So around Valentine's Day, it might have been about first loves and, and who got married when and, you know, what was your wedding dress like or you know, stuff like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, around Christmas, it was always about, you know, what did you do when you were young with Christmas? So and, and who's responsible for initiating these, uh, the, uh, bringing up the topics and initiating the conversation? Is that you? That's me. Okay. And so I kind of, you know, take a topic and then just create questions, but it doesn't stop there because the residents start interacting with each other and asking questions. Sure. And it, um, what we're doing today, this afternoon, is actually kind of like a show and tell. And why that started was because just before Christmas, one of the questions was, what was your favorite gift as a child? And two of our residents still have their doll over 70 years old. That they got for Christmas yeah. long, long ago. And they still have it. So last month, one lady brought it to show because we were all interested. And from that, I said, okay, it's got to be like, bring something and talk about it. And people are really interested. They're sweet and kind to each other and just want to know and hear about it. So it's great. Okay. Uh, a lot of movies uh, included. Uh, I'm looking at uh, some of the movies that you were showing during the month of March. Pay It Forward, Baker's Hawk, uh, The Story of Ruth, uh, one of the Sherlock Holmes movies. Mm -hmm. So is this, uh, do you have a, 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 an area uh, in, in one of the rec rooms where you can drop a big screen and, and show <laughs> a movie for? You should see our auditorium. I actually think big we are theater. probably big the. Big theater, okay. Okay. Only seniors yeah. residents yeah. around the lower mainland that has an auditorium. We can seat probably seated theater style about 120 people in there. Wow. It's yeah. huge. We yeah. have a full stage. Right. So that's where we're doing our theater. Oh, now theater. You're, you're, this is one of the choral groups yeah. that is feeling pretty self-confident yeah. and is going to move beyond choral performances and put on a full-blown musical. We're putting on a musical. It's going to be condensed probably to about an hour, but well, um, and we haven't picked the musical exactly, but we have so much talent there. Mm -hmm. uh, they can sing and we've got some great people that love to act. It's going to be a bit different. They maybe won't memorize every line, but we're going to kind of coordinate it, that it's going to work It'll really well. So it's It'll going be to be fun. fun. One of the things that I picked up off the website, because I generally like to scoot by the website before we sit down and have a chat just in case I'm I want so I can be as up to date sure. as you are when sure. when we sit down and one of the things and this is this is not fresh or new or anything in fact it's quite the opposite it's always been there on the website it describes Shannon Oaks as an all-inclusive premier independent living retirement home and what I wanted to, to get to you on is all-inclusive Jillian because that it's, it's, it would seem uh, sort of, well, yeah, of course it's all, it's a retirement home. Well, not but of it's course. it's not, of, not course, of course, and no. it's not all retirement homes as, as, as far as the all-inclusive aspect goes. That's correct. Some places uh, may just give you 20 meals a month. Some have a restaurant and give you $300 a month just for your meals, and which would, in that particular one, would maybe buy you 10 to 12 meals a month. So you have to look at that. At Shannon Oaks, we give you all your meals. Okay. Not only all your meals, and you've got one of the... I um, have a fantastic you, menu. <laughs> that's right. A you've full week's menu. menu. i got to tell you, I, I keep threatening to come by and, and, and uh, well, stiff Jillian I'm for I'm waiting. Lunch. I'm sitting here with the Just menu in my hand. give me a warning. Hand. I will definitely <laughs> warn you, and it won't be long. Okay. Okay? okay. But, the, uh, I'm but sorry. The, they, they have their three and choice, unbelievable yeah. choice on the menus. Um, but they, in addition to that, we have morning coffee and muffins we mm -hmm. have afternoon tea and co cookies and coffee and so there's snack and there's a huge wall of fruit all seasonal fruit you know like right now it's apples oranges bananas pears mm -hmm. you know kiwi fruit that you can take anytime 
as much as you like back to your apartment. I see. So to keep you healthy. So food, that's all inclusive right. in terms of that. And the cappuccino machine. Oh, the cappuccino. Uh, I see. Well, We've got a yeah. cappuccino latte machine. You can make yourself that. That's right. Yeah, oh, okay. that's all but inclusive. But this, no, this yeah. is important only because, and you just said it, and I think it bears saying again, because you're, a, you're the person that we boomers, and sometimes accompanied by our senior parents, you're the person that we sit across the desk from going, Okay, so what's this senior's uh, life business all about? How much does it cost? What's the deal? And in the course of educating ourselves, hopefully we're going to learn that it's, all things are not equal in the senior's retirement community uh, uh, scene. And uh, all-inclusive is something you really need to stop and go, okay, what exactly do you mean? That's by right. all inclusive. That's right. And, and and because you may get different responses. You will definitely get different responses. There's a whole variety out there. Some of them uh, ours includes 24 hour emergency response. Everybody is supposed to include that. Right. But our emergency response works anywhere in the building, in the garage, on the grounds. We know who you are, where you are when you press that buzzer. Okay. So that is a peace of mind. So some of them you walk 10 feet out of your apartment. And it no longer works. Oh, I see. So you can be in the hall mm -hmm. and fall. and that's one. So you've got to look at things in detail when it comes to that. The housekeeping. We not only, and when we do housekeeping, we take your sheets off the bed, laundry your sheets and your towels. Mm -hmm. Some places, you've got to do it all on your own. They'll come and clean your apartment, but that's it. So you've got to ask the question, and don't be afraid to ask. Well, and that's the key, isn't it? Because, you know, Canadians, we're typically pretty polite and pretty yeah. silly about it sometimes. We, we For actually, the most part. We actually deprive, <laughs> I know, but we actually deprive ourselves of, of some information because, oh, you know, we, I don't want to ask that. Mm -hmm. Or you But assume. you absolutely yeah. need not to assume and to be, again, proactive on yes. that. On If you're yes. doing the homework yes. and you're talking about uh, trying to persuade your mom or your dad, or in some cases, is both of them to completely change their lives and consider for the first time perhaps a very different lifestyle then by gosh you'd better be asking hard questions and one of the things you can do sterling is ask the person you're talking to can my mother or my father get a trial stay here ah okay can i come and stay for three to five days or something like that right you know, whatever it works is it possible and that is a good thing to do because then they see they get a little taste of what it's like. Right. You know, we also have staycations. A staycation is when, you know, your uh, the adult children are going on vacation. They don't want to leave mom and dad at home. Right. The way they're worried about her being alone. What are you going to do? Come to Shannon Oaks for that one week, two weeks, or whatever. Stay there. Mm-hmm. You know, and have all your meals done. Have the Just put your toe in the water. Right. See exactly. See what it's like. A good excuse. You can say to mom, we're going on a vacation, and you're going on a staycation. Mm -hmm. ah, we had okay. one move in just that last month. That's right. Yeah. Well, a, pers yeah. a person yeah. who had yeah. been for kind yeah. of a sample stay and she decided, for a week. this is okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that you encourage that. We do encourage that, yeah. Uh, okay. Give us a call. We'll set it up for you. You uh, tell us when you want to do it. We'll clear out the guest rooms as best we can and say, okay, they're available here, here, and here. We do have guest rooms, by the way. Right. It's whole suites that you can come. So if you have, for example, if you're a resident at Shannon Oaks and you're also uh, a grandparent, and that wouldn't be mm -hmm. too yeah. surprising, <laughs> uh, and uh, the kids want to come by for a visit, maybe stay overnight at Grandma's, yeah. a really cool new place, yeah. that's all right? Sure. Sure they can. And they can stay with you, with you in your apartment, or do they have to stay in a guest room? They can stay either. Either. If they walk okay, in the apartment or in the guest room. So it's, it's the grandparents' yeah. call then. That's eh? right. That's Interesting. Right. Yeah. But the idea is kick those tires. A ask the yeah. hard questions. Yeah. Get out yeah. there. Get on the Internet. Mm -hmm, yeah. And then start going around and visiting these communities. Physically get yourself into Educate them. Educate yourself. Yeah. And, and where possible, uh, stick around and stay for a few days. That's right. Invite mom or dad to come for a trial stay. We'd love to have them. All mm -hmm. right. Now, Jillian's number, by the way, uh, over there at Shannon Oaks, and Sharon's too, for that matter, <laughs> is 604-324-6257. Or if you want to get to, again, it was pretty fast, baptisthousing.org is the website. And then just click on Shannon Oaks and all of the communications information, phone numbers, emails, addresses, Google Maps, the whole shoot and match, it's right there on the website. That's correct. 
We'd Jillian, love to see you. Well, I, I, and I'm going to, I'll be by for lunch. He has to buy. Well, he has to. I absolutely will be by for lunch. I'm liking this menu a whole lot. Sharon Ginter, lovely to see you again. It's great being here. Oh, good to have you back. And Jillian Fullerton, always a pleasure. Thank you, Sterling. See you next time on Boomer Life.